Get me Edward G. Robinson on the phone, will you please? Yes, sir. Hello, Eddie. This is Mark. Yeah, in person. And to what am I indebted for the honor of this call, Mr. Hellinger? How are you, sweetheart? Say, Ed, I caught that new epic of yours last night at a sneak preview. What you mean, a slight case of murder? Say, tell me, how'd you like it? Happy, it's a socceroo. As a matter of fact, I'm heading my list of best bets with it in next Sunday's column. Well, that's swell, coming from you, Hellinger. You know, I've been wanting to get into an honest-to-goodness comedy for a heck of a long time. My wife has seen me die in pictures so often, she was beginning to feel like a celluloid widow. Well, Eddie, I've always wanted to see you play a Damon Onion story. Because Damon paints the big town and the guys and gals of Broadway as they really are. And that's right down your alley. I had one look at that script, and I offered to do it for nothing. Well, almost nothing. <laughs> it's a grand idea for a picture, all right. It certainly is. Now, here's a public enemy who was forced to retire from the rackets and wants to become a, a social butterfly. The only difference is, from now on, Remy is legitimate. What's going to happen now? Yeah, how about that? Oh, 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 I got I got up, it. It. I'm going to take care of every one of you guys. You're going to be salesmen. Salesmen? Only there's going to be a little change in our sales methods. Come on, boys. <laughs> Music room. Music room? Up to now, this has always been the slot machine room. Now, look, there'll be lots of people coming up here that are a cinch to take any one of these kids. So I don't want the best. I want the worst. Well, yeah, that's right. Now, give me the ugliest and toughest little gazebo you got. I want to mold them, see? And here, folks, we have Douglas Fairbanks Rosenblum. You talk like you're announcing a bout. Hello, Douglas. Hi, Toots. Hey, does the old dame live in the house, too? <laughs> Great stuff, isn't it? That way, 40 grand bores the paper, says dead or alive! Yeah, for 40 grand, you'd ruin my social reputation. Ah. Somebody shot them, boss. Shot them? Yes, sir, right there in that room. You've got to get them out of here. I can't have people like that around my house. What would the neighbors think? What would Mary's fiance think if he came in while they were here? Hey, what would anybody think? legitimate and it ain't my racket. I don't know the rules, so I'm going to play my own game. Starting right this minute, I'm going to be illegitimate. Well, what's he done? He was mixed up in that truck hold up. Don't go in there alone and try and arrest my father. You'd better bring your whole state troop with you. I want a policeman. Mm -hmm. 